All right, it's been uh, 72 hours and there hasn't been too much change uh, since yesterday, except that uh, on the gypsum, the uh, bubbles have disappeared on the gypsum. So the only one that still has bubbles on the side of the, of the glass is uh, the alum one. But uh, they all seem to be clearing up some. The raw has cleared up quite a bit. The, the alums look the same since uh, we put it in that 24 hours. And then uh, with the lime, it's actually clearing up too, but it's stained. And like I said, I bet I believe it's probably just because of the, the type of lime we used. Like I said, whatever holds that lime together for that granular is uh, what's causing the staining. And then the gypsum is cleared up pretty good. But at this point, it looks like the uh, gypsum and, and, and the lime are just about as clear as the raw minus the, the tanning effect from that brown, you know, from the brown stuff in there. But uh, there's, uh, like I said, we're gonna keep an eye on it a little bit longer. So far, it looks like uh, it might be a combination of both agitation and maybe a little bit of chemical makeup uh, when it comes to the uh, the the raw water because it has cleared up quite a bit now. Like I said not quite as much, but like I said, we'll give it a little longer and uh, see if it clears up more. But I think we might have to scratch these two, the lime and the gypsum. Maybe I'll find a, a better a better type of lime and gypsum. Maybe hit the tractor supply. I got this stuff from Ace Hardware. And maybe we can just find the more of a raw for form. But uh, that's about it for today. So until next time.